Do you think the Toronto Maple Leafs should actively pursue Patrick Kane, considering the potential challenges like cap space and trading players? Leafs Nation, Toronto Maple Leafs fans, join NHL fanatics at Leafs Nation. Subscribe now. Report. Patrick Kane a long shot for Maple Leafs, but a possibility. Kane is in talks with NHL teams about his return. NHL insider Chris Johnston lists potential landing spots, including the New York Rangers, Florida Panthers, Detroit Red Wings, Buffalo Sabres, and Toronto Maple Leafs. Johnston acknowledges Leafs as a longer shot but doesn't rule out the possibility. Leafs lack cap space and don't have a pressing need for Kane's skills with Marner and Nylander on right wing. However, the appeal lies in Austin Matthews, a Kane fan. Kane spent time in Greater Toronto Area during rehab. While other teams are more likely, Kane aims for a team for long-term success. If Kane joins the Leafs, challenges include clearing cap space, $22,499 available, and trading a player with a significant cap hit. Is it worth it, considering Kane's age, recent surgery, and uncertain contribution? Despite three Stanley Cups, can he replicate that success? The question for the Leafs, is it a risk they're willing to take? As a Leafs fan, how much sentimental value do you see in the prospect of Austin Matthews and Patrick Kane playing together, and do you think it could positively impact the team's performance? Stay up to date with the latest news from Toronto Maple Leafs. Click on this video on your screen. It's the most recent video on the channel. I'll wait for you on the other side.